Dear God, how much will it take for Malachi to understand I'm allergic to flowers? That is why there wasn't a centerpiece at that dinner. Stupid thing, let me just... What? Uh... Oops. I feel like I probably shouldn't go down there. Is that a- why is that piston two blocks below? Did Malachi use a block switcher? Impressive if he did. Well, might as well. Huh. Whoa. Whoa, okay, I... Me. What did he write about me? Vio is somehow the smartest and dumbest person I've ever met. I still have no idea how his mind works, even after spending what forever, what felt like forever dead, but with my thoughts. I plan on using this to my advantage until he no longer serves a use. I'm interested in the process he used for Ben. He was right on one thing, technology. It seems to be more of a reliable fit when it comes to any form of reincarnation or revival. I'll try this and salvage any of his research at a later date. Until he no longer serves a use. Huh. After his use has expired, he will too. I have no logical reason to keep him around after the events of the dinner. The plan at the moment is to take Ben somewhere to discuss future plans and dispose of him appropriately. Either that or I'll have some fun with it. How about another dinner? Why can't he just let me be? I didn't really want any of this. Maybe... Maybe if I stayed quiet about it, I could have just had a nice life. Complete revival. Previous methods failed. My current theory is that there may be a way to utilize a specialized stronghold, formerly used for communing with the dead, for complete revival, perhaps if combined with previ previous efforts. So it's the strongholds. I couldn't use the conduit. I, I couldn't because I had to transfer my soul and then my mind and use the conduit as a bridge in between. But if the if the if the stronghold is directly giving the mind and soul, then I, well, Vio, can return. What else does Malachi have? Sustaining infinite lives? Using special totems. There has to be a better way. I have I already have a working theory on that one, but revival dead travel logs. Right. He mentions that he can't he can't do anything. He can't go places he hasn't been. Places that are designed to kick him out. I have an idea. If if he goes through with this, then I know how I could stop him. Construct a maze with no prize. Labyrinth with no exit, but designed to contain him. If it's designed specifically to contain him, maybe it'll work. What does he have about Mace? I don't care if he's young, I don't care if he doesn't know better, he needs to stay out of my way. I have a plan on finding a way to make him avo make avoiding me harm him in some way. I, I think I've done it. I want to eliminate him from the equation entirely. He's never meant to exist, he has no purpose to serve. And if I, if I can find a way, I'll take him out myself. 
a wedding. Oh my god. The weather research. This is what I am interested in the most. The weather seems to have immense capabilities for causing death and preventing it. Wither roses can be used in large quantity for revival. Nether stars in the correct environment can be used to create weaponry that can deplete all lives. I need another star. This is the most important. Alien thought she was so clever. I'll admit I'm a fool for falling for it, and I let my guard down. She took me out. I don't care where her current reincarnation is. They're one of my top priorities for elimination. They don't know what to do. If this is what Malachi has in storage for me, fine. I have a plan. If Malachi continues on his path with me, his aggression and his talk about murdering me, then I'll take matters in my own hands. I'll find the descendant of Aelia. I'll find a way to arm them. Give them a chance. And they'll have to kill Miz and Malachi. Preserving his memory. In case of complete erasure, I'm looking into methods of preserving my memory somehow. Regrettably, I may have to ask Ben slash Vio for some help with this. There it is! I don't have to betray Malachi if, if he's just nice. I'll have to talk to him about this. Now that I know that he needs me for preserving his memory, then... I could talk to him comfortably about this. If what I have to do is betray Malachi, I don't want to. I feel deja vu right now. Maybe it's in relation to the dinner, or maybe it's something greater. I I don't want to betray Malachi. Malachi can be my friend. I, I quite liked him back then. I thought he was a good person. The Nether Star. Oh God, I'm no idiot. I know what I'm doing, and I know that one of you found this. I don't know what you plan to do with this information, but I will figure out who opened this book. I know it was most likely you, Vio. Stay out of my way. <sighs> Alright! But he can't strike me down until he figures out how I've sustained my memory. I died for a while, but I didn't instantly reincarnate and come back like he did. I waited. So he knows that I'm here, and I know what the plans he are he has for me are. So if that's the case, where are the other founders? Let me see. Is there anything else on any other founders? Uh, well, <laughs> at least I'm one of the four people that matters enough to have chests dedicated to him. Maybe read this. Plan at the moment is to take me somewhere. Discuss future plans. Dispose of me. An ambush. No, I don't... You shouldn't... You shouldn't betray him. He didn't know what he was doing last time. He didn't understand that. And if you betray him... Then he'll have every right to betray you again, but no, no, I have to betray him. You just, I just, you, I, we just don't understand that yet. Or is it something else? I'm taking this plan. 
It's coming with me, so that if anything happens, I have proof as to why I acted like I did. I don't want to fight Malachi. I want to be his friend, but if this is what I have to do in order to ensure my peaceful life, then this is what I have to do. I don't want to fight him. He's right. The founders weren't good. I agree with his views that the founders didn't listen. They didn't do anything for him or for me. The founders, for the most part, ignored me, too. But, but he's going to hurt me. I'll leave this here, and the next chance I get, I'll talk to him about it. And that will have to be that.